How's it going guys? It's me Simon and in this video I'm going to show you how to stream your PS4 to your PC or MacBook. So first head to your PlayStation and we're going to do some setting changes. So go up to settings, account manager, we want to set this PlayStation as your primary PlayStation so go down to activate as your primary, PS, primary PS4. Mine's already been activated and make sure your laptop or MacBook is connected to the same network as your PlayStation. So now we need to do some more changes. Go down to Remote Play, which is what is going to connect it. You want to tick that so it's enabled so that the PC or MacBook can find it later on. There's one more setting we need to do. This one's actually optional, depending if you want it to work in rest mode. So you just want to tick stay connected to internet and enable on PS4 from the network. So that's just the first part. We've just changed some settings on our PlayStation. Now we're going to move over to our PC. So now over to our PC or MacBook with the shaky camera. <laughs> we go to the PlayStation website for the download of the remote play software. So of course you pick PC or Mac depending on what you're using and wait for that to download. I'll put a link in the descriptions to this website. And then we want to open the installer. Do we want to give it access? Of course we do. English language for me, yep. Yeah. And then here's the setup wizard. So it should be simple now. We just have to follow the wizard and press next. Terms and conditions, we've seen this before. You can read it if you like. Next, and then save it where you want it and press install. So once it's been installed, you have this new blue PlayStation icon on your screen. Grab your PS4 controller and plug it in via USB. And now we can open up the PS4 Remote Play app. And once it's opened, it says you can connect your controller, which we've already done. Now we need to press the options button. Once we press that button, it'll take us to a new screen. Yep. It's gonna, we need to confirm and continue. And now it'll ask us to sign in with our PS4 accounts. So I'm just gonna sign in quickly. So once you've signed in, It'll start searching for your PlayStation 4 and there we go, it's connected via Remote Play and I can control both my PlayStation and the Remote Play app with my controller. So now it's actually streaming the PlayStation to our laptops. And it looks fantastic and there is no lag. Let's make it full screen. You can see there's no lag. So we should test this out with a game now. Okay guys, we're testing out the PS4 Remote Play app and this is the boss battle in Yakuza 6. Here we go. We're at standstill at the moment. Okay, you see the fight in the people's eyes? I'm the guy in the jacket, Kurai. And he's Samaya. Samaya. Okay, he's just drinking beer. <laughs> I couldn't attack him when he was drinking beer. Here we go. Chuck him. Beast mode. And plants. Yes. Potted plants are the weapons of choice here. Here we go. Can I get my special? Here we go. Boom. Take that to the face, man. Okay, we're going to a cutscene now. Ooh. This game looks beautiful on my laptop. It looks better than compared to the one on TV. Whoa, he Superman punched me. I think I'm gonna use to throw him and pick up a couch. No, plant it is. Wait, ah! Block. Oh, he took me down. 
couch. He kicked the couch out of my hand. Kick. Okay. I can't block any of these. Kick. Okay. Beast mode! Here we go. He blocked it. Did he block it? And he is defeated. I've taken him out. So there you go guys, that is how you stream your PlayStation 4 to your PC or MacBook using the Remote Play app. If you enjoyed this video, leave me a like, consider becoming a subscriber for more content like this. Thank you for watching and peace out.